You've heard a lot about Fast and Furious in the news these days, but since most in the media have not been covering the story, let me give you some background. The title came from a 2009 movie about an ill-conceived plan to infiltrate the Mexican drug cartels that ended up with a whole lot of people dying. That pretty much sums up the real-life Fast and Furious that's in the news now. It all started in 2006 under the Bush administration. The plan was to allow 2,000 guns to get into Mexico and into the hands of cartel members so we could track those guns. And then we lost most of them. Only about 700 have been recovered. Many of those guns have been traced back to the mass murder of hundreds, possibly thousands of people south of the border, and to the murder of U.S. Border Patrol agent Brian Terry in 2010. It was after that killing that Congress started demanding some answers from the Justice Department about Fast and Furious. Now, you're going to hear that this is all about politics, but it's much more about the murder of Brian Terry and the mass murders in Mexico as this investigation started long before this election cycle. The Obama administration has released thousands of documents about Fast and Furious, but the investigative committee specifically won some documents from the last two years, and that's what Eric Holder and the Justice Department has refused to give up. President Obama has claimed executive privilege to protect the documents, so out of nowhere, the White House is involved, and Eric Holder is now being held in contempt of Congress by the committee. The only logical conclusion is the White House has something to hide, so now a story that nobody was talking about, everybody is talking about, including the parents of Brian Terry, who released a statement saying, our son lost his life for this country. It is very disappointing that we are now faced with an administration that seems more concerned about protecting themselves rather than revealing the truth. The Terry family deserves answers. We all do.